Hello, my name is Jerry Bear. I got my Bear Creek Arsenal 9mm here. Brand new gun I just got. We'll let you see a couple shots. Shoot pretty darn good. Jerry Bear signing off. What's up ninjas? Today we're doing just a tiny little range day, a short little sweet little mini range day. So we have the Ruger Mark IV with the new Cherry Bomb. Cherry Bomb and the Plan V mount. So just going to take a few shots with, I got the Ruger 1022. So this is just a little 22 episode. We're having a little 4th of July celebration on the 6th of July. So nice little quiet Saturday with the 22s. So I'm just going to, I've got two mags loaded up at this and I got a few mags for the 1022 and it'll probably just be a short little video. So nothing too crazy today. Let you guys in on a little secret. This is the Ruger Mark IV. Not really a secret. But uh, I am going to be getting a little red. I already posted a short of it, but I am going to put a Hollow Sun uh, 507K on top of here. Have a cool little red dot action. Let me switch it up for you guys. Give you guys a, a James Bond style Ruger Mark IV. Yeah, so this thing's super quiet. I'll probably load up a couple more mags, but I got the 1022. I'm going to take some shots with that and we'll uh, be done with the video. All right, we got the 1022, the 25 round mags. Nothing too crazy. This is a lot louder than that silenced one. Uh oh. We had a jam. Damn, this thing's jamming like crazy. I've got like three live rounds on the ground that I need to pick up. Yeah, I, it's probably this ammo. This ammo is probably... 15 years old. Yeah, dropped like three of them. Got another mag. Hopefully this one doesn't jam as much. We'll try a little rapid fire. Oh, that one had a jam. Yeah, the old 1022. I haven't really shot this thing at all. I've shot it. This is probably the most I've shot it. I want to get one with a threaded barrel so I can put the silencer on it. That one was a little better. So, if you're not familiar with the BX25s, they're the Ruger brand 25 rounders, not 30 rounds, 25 rounds. And we are at a private range. There's no people around. This is a safe and controlled environment. There's no children around, so we're just doing our thing. 
out here at the mini the mini range a little private mini range action Yeah, I'm going to say maybe it's the magazines. I don't know. I, it's probably the ammo, though. This ammo sucks, dude. It's like 15 years old at least. And we're out. All right. So this is not performing that well. I'm going to chalk it up to the ammo. I have to try some different ammo next time. I don't really shoot the 22s a whole lot, but I figured we might as well try it out. It's been a while since we've, we've just planked. All right. So far, the cherry bomb's holding up good. I was kind of worried because the threads were... There wasn't many threads on the muzzle device, but... Seems to be holding up fine. Not really like 22 has a whole lot of pressure anyway. So I am going to do a little sound comparison and uh, just take a couple more shots with this and we'll be done. Also, it's really hard to see the sights because the silencer is like just barely eclipses it. So if I miss, don't flame me in the comments. We'll shoot the wood block. Pretty cool. All right, we'll do a little sound comparison without the silencer, and we'll be done. But I'm just doing two rounds. Nothing too crazy. I do have earbuds in. So I'm not uh, I'm not going out without protection. I'll tell you that. That's two rounds. So yeah, we'll we'll compare those, and I'm sure the silencer is way quieter. That's gonna be it for this video, guys. Just something short and sweet. Hope you guys had a good Fourth of July, Independence Day, and uh, the Bear Creek Arsenal works now. I got the ejector fixed. Just wanted to get a little clip of that on camera. Ruger Mark IV with the Cherry Bomb is pretty sweet. I like how I don't have to switch between the adapters. So this is uh, going to get a red dot, and it's going to be pretty sweet. So that's, that's it for this video, guys. Sorry it wasn't super in-depth, but we're doing a little celebration out here. So I just brought a couple guns just to get, get some content filmed. So check out the website, 2aninja.com, and we'll see you guys in the next one.